I knocked. I guess you didn't hear. No, oh, I heard you. I'm here to see Senator Jennings. Lex, if you want to sling some mud, I strongly recommend you do it at somebody else's house. Don't worry, I'm not holding my breath for your vote. <sighs> you know, I've never liked you all that much, Lex, but even I'm surprised by the depths you're willing to sink to. And I'm sure you have such a good view of it all from your pulpit. Holier than thou is an easy fallback, Mr. Ken. It keeps you from really looking at the people around you. I've known Jack for over 25 years. I've never had a more trustworthy or loyal friend. This state needs somebody like him. Somebody who's willing to stand by their word. Somebody who's willing to do what's right for everybody, not just for himself. Somebody who's willing to go up against people like you. Well, if you know him so well, maybe you should ask your good old boy to explain this to you. After Clark's visit, I decided to look into the senator's unfortunate snapshot myself. It's his uh, cell phone record. Seems he's been calling his dead stripper friend a little more than frequently. When are you releasing this? I'm not. But if I found it, you know the press won't be far behind. I thought he'd like a heads up. <laughs> 